I tried to stay active and I tried to stay healthy and I actually changed my diet a complete 180 about a year ago. So I like to keep track of all of my vitals. I have the smart scales to keep track of body weight, what's fat, what's muscle. And another thing that I like to keep track of is my blood pressure. If you make a change to your diet, it could have lots of different effects on you. And one of those things could be your blood pressure. So I like to also monitor that. So the timing on this was perfect because I was actually gifted an eye health blood pressure tracker and I've actually bought a bunch of at-home COVID testing kits from this company so I've been buying products from this company for a long time so it was really cool that they gave me one of these to review and I'm very impressed with it let's first off see what's in the box when you get it so when you unbox this you are going to get the actual health monitor and the pressure cuff which you're going to put around your arm and also I love when companies do this they include the battery so you don't have to go buy batteries you can pull this thing out of the box, put it together, and it's ready to go. Okay, so let's talk about the initial setup. So when you first get this, if the cuff is not going through this like a belt buckle, then I want to explain the best way to set it up just so it's not confusing. If it's already set up, great. If it's not and you have to start from scratch, this is how we're going to do it. Start with the Velcro side up, turn it into a round cuff and put it through the metal, just like you would a belt buckle, so that it is returning back on itself. Now, when you put it on your arm, just slide your arm in, make sure there's nothing in the way, and the tube is going to go down your arm, right in the center of your arm, right by your elbow. There's actually an artery that runs this way through your arm, and that's what this red mark is. This is an artery mark. So tube on the top of your arm, then you can just tighten it here, and as you bring it around, let the Velcro hold on there. You're gonna notice the actual little insignia of an arm showing you that you have it set up the right way. So as long as yours looks like that, you're good to go. Then you plug it in to the health monitor and it says in the directions which are included here I suggest you also read them but it says to relax then for a few moments and that you want this cuff to be about the same level as your heart so if you're sitting up lay your arm on something so that your cuff is at the same level of your heart or if you're laying flat on your back as long as your arm is on your side then it's going to be about the same level as your heart and then pretty simple start stop just hit start and it's ready to go it's going to start filling up and it's going to take a little less than a minute. You can see the little heart beeping on there showing that it is actually successfully monitoring. And then it will come up with the results and it will also have color coding. So green is good, yellow is high to normal, and red is in the danger zone. And I actually did this multiple times. The first time I did it, I was completely in optimal zone. But now that I'm actually filming a video, my heart rate is up a little bit. So you can kind of ignore these results, but that's how crazy accurate these things are. When I did it by myself, I was green and when I do it in front of a camera it's yellow pretty crazy but it's very very easy to use it has pretty simple instructions in the manual plus right on the cuff it seems to be very accurate it is picking up the tiny nuances in my heart rate based on whether or not I'm filming like I said I have bought products from this company in the past and I've been happy with them and this is just another one in the line that I am happy with you can also sync this to their phone app in order to track your progress in real time rather than keeping it somewhere like on a notepad and then you can also share those results with the doctor so it has too many bells and whistles to even talk about here I'm very happy with it if you are looking for a solution to track your blood pressure both on a machine and on a phone app this is definitely one that I'm happy with and that I would recommend